Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you guys how to do a quick installation for the headlight for the Jeep Grand Cherokee L, so let's get started. Okay, so before starting, just to help out, you could lift up the hood just to give you room to work around here, that way you're able to seal the film. So just lift up the hood. Once you have this area open, we can start with the cleaning process, so clean it up with slip solution. This one, you're just gonna meet it up to the corner of the headlight. So right there should be fine. Once you place it, make sure it goes around here. Once you have it there, with tack solution, tack it down. So once that's there, it's ready to be stretched. So as you can see, when you just lay the film, it doesn't reach up to the end of the lens. So we're just gonna stretch it once it's tacked down, that way, we meet it up to the edge of here and here, and we just squeegee and it tacks down. So if the film does get dry, just lift it up, apply a slip solution, and then just make sure your hands are a bit dry to get a grip, stretch it, and then have it in place. So it should meet there and there. And then with tack solution, tack it down. And then from there, it's just tacking down everything. So just lift the film just a bit, wash out all the solution, and just tack everything down. And then once it's tacked down with heat, just help it seal it to tack it down. And it should be good. Yeah, once you're done, it should sit flush. So the only thing you just have to worry about is this little curve right here. With tack solution and with a little bit of heat, the film should sit properly onto the headlight. So as you can see, there's no bubble. So you just wanna make sure you pass your finger. And with heat, just tack it all down. Okay, so that concludes the installation video for the headlight for the Jeep Grand Cherokee L. Simple installation, just make sure you tack it down here first on this corner. And then once it's tacked down, you end on this side and just with heat and a little bit of tack solution it should sit perfectly to the lens but if you guys do have any other questions feel free to comment below or message us directly and we'll be happy to help you guys out until then see you guys on the next video